Yeah, hi, it's Martin here from uh, WordPress Wizardry, and in this video, we're actually going to go and have a look at a product uh, which is all about video creation. Video is so huge at the moment, and if you're not actually using some form of video, either on websites or on capture forms, etc., then you're definitely missing out. Let's go and have a look at uh, Go Aminate and uh, find out exactly what it's all about. So as you can see in the top right hand corner, I'm actually in my account here, so we're going to go and make a video. You come through to this page here, you can obviously watch the tutorials, which is great. You can make a video from scratch, which is fantastic, but what they also have is loads and loads of different templates. So you can just choose one of these templates and then go and edit it as you please. Or like you say, you can go and start from scratch. So let's go and uh, have a look at one of these templates where you can see a back end of how it all goes together. Okay, so we're in like the creative side of it. It comes up with a, a tutorial. So if you want to start a tutorial, it's uh, one good thing about this. It has loads of different tutorials. So you can go and find out all about it. Let's just cross that down. And uh, as you can see here, we've uh, loaded uh, this template up. And you can just drag and drop elements into this. If you want to change the background, you can do different characters here. And then again, you can just drag and drop people into the actual video, like so. You can also do different props. So let's have a look what we've got here. We could put a percentage sign up there. If he was talking about something to do with uh, conversions or something. You've obviously got a text element here, which uh, we can click on. So you can then again do speech bubbles and that sort of thing. And just drag and drop it to wherever you want. It gives you the option here to do different fonts and obviously different size fonts, different colors, styles, etc. You've obviously got different effects here as well, so you can add motions and that sort of thing. So loads and loads of different variations that you can add into your actual video. You've also got uh, sound, so you've got loads of pre-loaded background music, etc. that can be loaded in very, very easily. And quickly, again, you would just uh, click on it, and as you can see down here, in the bottom half of the screen, we have a frame-by-frame -frame view of your actual video. So again, and if you want to add different elements to it, you can add stuff through here as well. So you can click on it and you can um, obviously duplicate certain things. You can add the volume, so you can have the volume up higher or lower for a background track, etc. So the other thing we have obviously is what they call starters here. So you can put different little sort of scenes in at the beginning of a video. So as you can see, loads and loads of different things uh, that you can do. You can obviously uh, save the video here. You can preview it as well and it also gives you options of um, the different qualities you want you can save as a starter or the whole video all that sort of thing so loads and loads of different aspects to the video if you wanted to find that uh, there was one element you put in there and then you wanted to undo you could just literally click the undo element and keep going back as far as it lets you Okay, so we can take that element right out and then save and then start again. So once it saves, it stays in your account and then you can come back and edit it at another time. So you can build this up over a period of time. Okay, so that's uh, the sort of nuts and bolts of it. As you can see, you could probably go in here and spend hours looking at everything that they do. Uh, obviously, the video tutorials are there for you to help you aid you do that. So let's go and have a look and see uh, how much this is actually going to cost you to try and use. Okay, so we've come into the uh, plans and uh, pricing part here. And as you can see, there are three different uh, types of plans that we have here. The Go Publish, the Go Premium, and the Go Team. Uh, and as you can see, it gives you all the different variations here of what you get and what you don't get. And obviously the price is at the bottom here, starting from $39 a month for the Go Publish. Now the only thing uh, that I'm looking at here, obviously there's certain questions here that you've got. 
as well, which so, so certain things can be answered about your free trial, because they do offer a free trial. When you first sign up, then uh, you do get offered a free trial at the top here, which you can take, which is a 14-day trial. Okay, so that's uh, the sort of like the, mo the workings of uh, Go An Animate and uh, the pricing, etc. So what do I like about it? Well, I like the ease uh, of how you can just drag and drop elements into the video and edit stuff. Very, very easy to do, very simple, and obviously you can see exactly what you're doing on the screen at all times, which is good. I like the way also you can add in your own stuff and you can make your own videos as well, so you can customize absolutely everything to your own taste. And obviously the free trial. Free trial is, uh, yeah, if you're looking at a product to begin with, not quite sure whether it's going to meet your um, requirements then to actually be able to take that free trial is a good thing and obviously the video tutorials having loads of video tutorials if you do get stuck and you're looking to do a certain uh, thing then having the video tutorials is great okay so what don't i like about go animate well there's a couple of things and i'm not keen solely on the sort of cartoon aspect of videos anyway so that doesn't really appeal to me, but saying that, a lot of people will like that. They like that sort of video, and it's very, very popular. So that's just my personal opinion on that. I'm not too keen on a monthly fee as well, to be honest. Um, I like to buy products once I've bought the product, but I've got it there. Because I do make quite a few videos, but I don't make a lot of videos. And, um, unless you're literally using this as a business to create videos for other people, then a monthly fee could be yeah, not worthwhile. The last thing is if you are using your uh, Go Animate to make um, videos for other people, just be careful because you have to look in the in the questions at the back. It's a little bit confusing where they say that you are, you are able to sell to individuals, but if you're selling to businesses and companies, then you have to pay an extra charge for a license fee, etc. So, I'm not quite sure, it's a bit of a grey area there. If you've got a network marketer, he is an individual, but he's also a business. You know, do you, is it something you have to sell to him, or do you have to pay extra, can you sell it to him, whatever. So if you are looking to do that, then obviously just double check with him before purchasing and obviously selling, because you could sell a video on and be breaking their terms and conditions. But other than that, um, yes, good product, video products, videos are really, really good at the moment. Like I say, right at the beginning, if you are not using video, you can give, uh, go animate a try. You can go and grab their 14 day trial and go and have a look for yourself. Okay, uh, that's me done. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for listening.